Hey guys, how y'all doing today? So, hopefully you've had a great weekend. Um, it's Monday right now. And I hope your week goes fabulous. Anyway, I wanted to just update. Um, this is my under 1000 sub build. The 1962 Bel Air Super Sport of Dave Strickler. Um, I had problems with the paint, as usual, with my builds. I uh, finally got it painted. The weather turned decent. So I finally got it painted. Uh, basically just finished it. So it's a 62 Bel Air. Um, the interior, you've all seen it. If you've seen the other videos I've had, you've seen the interior. Um, the paint's not bad. There's, you know, I'm not, I'm not real good at painting. And I do have kind of shaky fingers, so when I was doing around the windows, I did slip a couple times. Um, all in all, though, this is a really good kit. Um, goes together really good. Everything fits nicely. I had really no other problems besides my paint <clears throat> for some reason though the windows were not clear uh, they were in the baggie but they weren't clear when I brought them out and I'm not to the point yet where <clears throat> I'm comfortable trying to sand and polish things especially windows and bodies so I'm getting I have some extra bodies I'm going to be practicing on that um, and let's see, get the engine open here. There's the engine compartment. I did wire it. First time doing um, battery wires, battery cables. For the most part, the decals came out good. Uh, I got the driver's side done, everything went on nicely. And then I went to do the passenger side, and the two bigger decals on the passenger side did not want to cooperate. Something with the paper, um, there was like, on the big decal, there was like two corners that wouldn't come off. It, it, it just tore completely. It would not unstick from the paper. And then the, the smaller decal here was the same thing. One, one side of the decal paper would not like when it gets wet it changes color it wouldn't even change colors it was just dead and it just got stuck so with that I got the decals on the driver's side and I'm happy with that all in all though you know it was a good build um, the weather is nice I'm looking forward to moving on to my next build <clears throat> but I wanted to thank both Rob over at Time Machine Mo Scale Models and Mike over at Mike's Model Shop uh, for putting on this show, I mean putting on this build, this group build. Um, it's been very helpful. Uh, I did, I was able to get um, additional, some additional subscribers from this and that was the whole intent and purpose of this group build was to help out those who are under a thousand subscribers get some more subscribers <clears throat> but anyway thank you very much hope you enjoy it uh, looking forward to the next build and I will talk to you guys again later bye